When Luke ventured into the forest for his daily walk, he never expected to become a hero. Hearing the frantic noise of an old well, he looked inside and found a leopard struggling to stay afloat. Without thinking twice, he took action. But as he approached the exhausted animal, he saw something that made him stop. In the murky water, the leopard was fiercely guarding something unexpected. Luke has been down this path a thousand times. It was his favorite route as it passed by an abandoned house. Sometimes he would enter through a hole in one of the gates, which he wanted to do this time too. But as he walked to the house, he heard a loud noise coming from the well in the house's front yard. Intrigued by what might be inside, he went to the well and peered over the edge. His eyes widened in shock when he saw a huge animal splashing around in the dark pit, desperately trying to get out. He quickly turned on the flashlight on his phone and shined it. He gasped when he finally realized what he was looking at. The animal trying to get out was actually a leopard. Its big eyes looked straight into the lantern. The poor animal, covered in dirt, was tired and was quickly losing energy. Luke knew he had to do something or else this leopard wouldn't survive. He frantically looked around for something, anything that could help the animal get out of there. He picked up some scattered wooden planks, but none of them were long enough to reach the well. Without wasting a single second, he rushed towards the abandoned house. Perhaps there was a staircase left by the previous owners. But as he searched the dark basement, he found nothing but rats and rusty tools. As he walked past the abandoned house, he noticed a shed in what used to be the backyard. He quickly ran over there and burst through the door. The shed was dusty and full of cobwebs, but Luke brushed them all away like they were nothing. Yes, he said to himself as he spotted a long, thick rope in the corner of the shed. He quickly retrieved the rope and returned to the well with it trailing behind him. Luke understood the danger of what he was about to do. Entering a well with no one around to help and uncertain about the leopard's reaction to his presence. Tying one end of the rope around the well and the other around his waist, Luke threw it over the edge, waiting for it to reach the water. He grabbed the rope, positioned himself above the well, and began his descent. His hands started hurting, knowing he would burn himself with the rope, but he persevered. As he descended, his phone suddenly rang in his pocket. Initially ignoring it, Luke grew anxious, wondering why someone was so desperate to contact him. Balancing the options, he reluctantly reached into his pocket, risking a potential fall. Wrapping the rope around his wrist, he attempted to answer the call. However, as he pulled out the phone, his fingers slipped and it dropped into the well. Luke's phone's sudden drop startled the leopard, prompting a growl. Frustrated, Luke continued his descent, hearing the phone vibrate underwater but realizing it was impossible to retrieve with the leopard present. As he descended, Luke approached the leopard cautiously, mindful of its protective posture. Nervous and exhausted, he was aware of the potential danger. The leopard, seemingly tired, remained still clinging to the wall. Upon reaching the floor of the well, Luke realized the futility of his plan. Standing in cold water, he questioned how the leopard would react to being pulled up and whether he had the strength to climb back. Approaching the leopard cautiously, Luke communicated his intention to help without provoking aggression. Each step was measured, and he spoke in a low, soft tone to convey peace and goodwill. Maintaining eye contact, Luke and the leopard seemed to communicate without words, recognizing their shared predicament. Luke gestured gently, trying to show he meant no harm, and extended his hand as a sign of peace. The leopard's stance relaxed slightly, indicating a tentative confidence as Luke prepared for his next move. The animal's breathing, though still rapid, suggested a sense of understanding and acceptance of Luke's genuine desire to help. This small change fuels Luke's determination to save not only himself, but also the magnificent creature before him. Needing help, he searches the murky water for his fallen phone, trying not to scare the leopard. Luke's fingers probe the cold, muddy bottom for the device, heart sinking with each passing second. Against all odds, he finally finds his phone and lifts it from the water, miraculously still functional. He quickly calls emergency services, explaining his situation urgently. Luke maintains a line of communication with the dispatcher, describing the depth of the well and the leopard's condition. 
While waiting for the rescue team, Luke speaks to the leopard, calming and reassuring it. In the dim light, their eyes meet, conveying a shared experience of uncertainty and hope. Luke can't see what the leopard guards in the dark water, but he senses its importance. He continues to speak softly, promising safety and help, building a fragile bond. Every word is a thread that weaves a tapestry of trust between man and animal. In the darkness, these whispers are a pact, a shared hope of survival. The rescue team's distant sirens grow louder, and Luke prepares for their arrival, moving slowly to ensure safety. The well, once a trap, now seems like the starting point of their imminent journey to safety. As the rescue team approaches, Luke balances himself and the leopard for the crucial moments to come. He takes a deep breath, suppressing the storm of emotions inside him. Together, humans and animals on the brink of salvation wait for the first signs of liberation to appear from above. The rescue team arrives, assembling their equipment and coordinating efforts with Luke below. The sound of clanging metal and voices echo through the shaft. Luke watches as ropes and pulleys are secured, instilling confidence in him. Rescue teams lower equipment and personnel into the well, and Luke steps back, giving them space to work. The descent is methodical, bringing them closer to safety with each arrival. Luke's heart races as he realizes the magnitude of what is happening. Powerful lights illuminate the pit, temporarily scaring the leopard. Luke soothes with a gentle voice, adjusting to the brightness. Despite the chaos, Luke remains calm, assisting in the rescue and positioning himself as instructed. Luke's voice is a steady presence in the whirlwind of activity, a calm anchor. The team secures the perimeter, ensuring a safe environment. Panicked by the noise, the leopard unexpectedly clings to Luke seeking comfort. Luke and the leopard find solace in each other's presence, their bond becoming a source of unexpected comfort. Luke whispers reassuring words to the terrified leopard. Together, they share a moment of peaceful connection amidst the confusion. In a moment of fragile peace, Luke and the leopard wait as the team prepares to lift them up. The well, once dangerous, now feels like a cocoon. They remain close two survivors on the verge of salvation. The team fastens harnesses around Luke and the leopard, preparing them for the climb. Luke assists with careful movements. Together they are tied, ready to be lifted from darkness into light, their journey from despair to hope almost complete. As the rescue operation continues, the water shifts, revealing a small shape near Luke and the leopard. Luke spots the small form, his curiosity peaked. The team begins to lift them, leaving the darkness behind, ascending towards the light and the unknown. With the surface in sight, tension and hope mix as the rescue approaches the crucial moment. Luke's palms sweat against the ropes as anticipation grows. The leopard senses the change, its body tense, ready for an emergency. Hovering between dangerous depths below and promising salvation above, they approach the top. As they near the surface, a beam of light reveals a small creature the leopard was guarding. Luke's eyes widen in shock and awe, the last puzzle piece falling into place. The revelation brings a new dimension to their shared ordeal. To everyone's surprise, the rescue light illuminates the small, frightened creature. Gasps echo as eyes widen with fear. The leopard's protective stance suddenly makes sense, a narrative unfolding wordlessly in the bright glow. The discovery brings a wave of emotions. Surprise, sympathy, and renewed urgency wash over them. The team's movements become more cautious, fueled by the realization they are now saving three lives. With the discovery, the team works diligently to ensure the safety of all. Luke watches anxiously as they implement a delicate plan. It's a tense dance of survival, each step bringing them closer to a successful rescue. Luke, the leopard, and the little creature ascend together, their destinies intertwined. The upward journey is tense, every inch of distance a triumph. Luke keeps a close eye on his companions, their shared experience creating an unspoken bond. As they reach the surface, applause erupts from the rescue team. Luke breathes deeply, the fresh air a balm for his tired soul. The leopard, still nearby, seems to understand that the ordeal is over. Together they walk into the light, the weight of darkness lifted. 
Luke emerges from the well as a hero, applauded and cheered. His actions, once motivated by instinct, are now celebrated by the community and the rescue team. He remains humble and proud, a silent hero. As the leopard is nursed to safety, Luke shares a tender farewell. Their eyes meet in a silent conversation of thanks. The leopard, once a symbol of danger, is now part of their story, a shared memory of survival. The story of the puppy's fall and the leopard's protection unfolds. The community listens with admiration, touched by the heartwarming narrative. The story highlights the unpredictable nature of life and the enduring spirit of survival. The incident sparks unity and care in the community with offers of support and admiration. Luke's courageous act and the bond between the leopard and the little dog resonate, emphasizing the power of collective compassion. Luke reflects on the rescue, the unexpected bond formed, and the profound impact of the ordeal. The experience changes him, leaving an indelible mark. The story makes headlines, winning hearts globally, a poignant narrative amid challenging news. The local community and animal welfare organizations honor Luke. Ceremonies and awards acknowledge his selfless act and positive impact. Luke, humbled and overwhelmed, stands amidst the praise. Deciding to adopt the puppy, Luke brings the little creature into his home. The story ends with a reflection on the leopard's compassion and the bonds between species. Luke realizes that compassion transcends species, a universal language spoken in shared vulnerability. Taking one last walk beyond the well, Luke ponders the changes in his life and the paths altered by the daring rescue. The well, once a place of fear, becomes a monument to courage and unexpected friendships. As he walks away, carrying memories and lessons, the sun sets, symbolizing closure to an expanded heart.